Or are you struggling to find, find friends? friends? Or are you being ignored by everyone on Discord? Well, do, do not, not worry, worry, because with this one simple trick, you can obtain lots of friends! Bruh. I honestly sound like one of those online scams that want to take your money now. <laughs> Basically guys, recently I found a way to fake yourself playing Hytale on Discord. I know, you might ask, what's the point of this? This is so dumb. Well, I mean, if you really just want a bit of clout or your you want a bit of attention, you know, just like me. Then you can just do this little trick and everyone's gonna think you have Hytale and they're gonna message you saying, How do you get Hytale? What the heck? I mean, it's a cool little prank to pull and I mean, you can only pull this trick until the Hytale release date because I mean, when Hytale is released, this trick won't have any meaning anymore. Let's be honest here, right? Let me just time over! But in all seriousness though, in today's video, I'm gonna teach you guys how you can do this little simple trick. I don't know if you guys are interested at all, but I mean, you know, it's a cool little trick for you to get a bit of clout. So why the heck not, right? So to start things off on this little trick, first thing you want to do is open up your web browser, which I hope you know how to do. I mean, it's kind of basic computer knowledge. All right, so the next thing you want to do, guys, is to head to the website discord.com and uh, it will bring you to this page. So the next thing you want to do is you want to log into your Discord account. I presume you have a Discord account. If you don't have a Discord account, why are you watching this video? Okay, upon logging in, Discord will bring you to your Discord, if you know what I mean. Whoa. Which is not the place you want to be. So what you want to do is, you want to go and delete this activity on the top bar and just go to discordapp.com and it'll lead you back to the front page, which is where you want to be. The next thing you want to do is you want to click on developers and click on developer portal. So now you'll be brought to the developer portal page. You shouldn't have any applications here, but well, I have two applications here. The, the one I just did and a failed bot. Just ignore it, guys. So you want to create an application. Just click on wherever to create an application is, it, it should be there. So the next thing that will happen is that it will ask you to name your application. So you make sure you name your application correctly because this name will be the name that's going to be showing up on your Discord rich presence. So since we're faking Hytale, we're going to name it Hytale. I mean 200 IQ, right? Obviously that's why you're going to name it. Whoa. Do know that you cannot change your name later on. So it's just best not to name it something like Beat Your Meat 21 unless you're actually intending for that to come out, which I think is pretty weird, not going to lie. All right, your app icon isn't that important. We can just ignore that. The next thing you want to do is you want to click on Rich Presence and you now want to select your cover image. So, all right, so now you want to select the picture for Hytale. You can just go online, search for Hytale and take whatever Hytale logo. I found this one. I think this one's the best. If you guys want to download link to this, I'll put it in the description as well. So you want to select this and now you have your Hytale cover picture. Whoa. Wow, that was incredibly complicated. Am I right? Bruh. Okay, the next thing you want to do is you want to go to the Rich Presence asset and click on Add Image images and add the same image and now you want to rename your image to something that you would remember okay this is important because you need this name for later on so naming it this is going to make your life a lot harder than naming it Hytale or Hytale image or whatever you want to name it right remember you have to use this later okay so don't name it something that you can't remember so the next thing you want to do is you want to go up and open a new tab and go to the website tinyurl.com slash binner Hytale trick I made a shortcut so you guys can remember it this easily. And you'll be brought to this GitHub page where you need to download the next program. Well, you just need to scroll down here and go to Fixes and Optimizations V3.0 or whatever is the latest release. But uh, I'm going to suggest for you to go to V3.0 just in case a later release he changes it and it's not going to be relevant to this video anymore. You know, that kind of problem. Obviously, if you're Windows, you download the Windows jar. If you're Linux, you download the Linux jar. And if you're Mac, well, I'm sorry, please change your computer to Windows. Bruh. I'm kidding. I don't know why he hasn't released something for Mac, but since most of us are Windows users anyways? Okay, I probably just offended everyone who uses Mac. I'm kidding, okay? He hasn't released the Mac version, so I can't help you with that. I'm sorry. Okay, so now you just need to click on it to download it. Whoa. Wow, that was incredibly difficult. Bruh. All right, so now that you have downloaded your file, now you just have to right click on it and click extract here. And boom, now you have your file. All right, cool. All right, so now you want to open up the file and you will see three files here, config, ecrp, and readme. Well, the ecrp is the application you have to run later, but first of all, we have to config it. What you want to do is you want to open up the configuration file and you'll be faced with this menu. To start things off, you want to go back to your Discord developer portal and go back to general information. Here, under your app name, you will see something called client ID. So what you want to do is you want to click on the copy button and boom, now you have copied it. <laughs> Next thing you want to do is you want to go back to the config file and under client ID, change this random string of numbers that you put there 
to your Discord ID. All right, the next thing you want to do is you want to put your state. Now, for some reason, details comes before state, but to make things easier, you can just put everything under details. But if you want like two layers of stuff, then you're going to have to use both. So for example, let's say we want to do something like playing survival. And then for state, we can do like maybe two hours elapsed because every other game has this for some reason. So in order to make this look more legit, we can do that. All right, so here's the next challenging part, okay? This is actually a test of your intelligence. You want to remember what you named your your picture. This is a test of your intelligence. If you can copy the name of your picture on the large image. Okay, we named it Hightail, so I'm just gonna put Hightail there. If you can't remember what you named your image, then you must have below 10 IQ. Bruh. Alright, now that you have put that in, you have actually done it. So now what I'm gonna do is you wanna save this file and close it. The next thing you wanna do is you wanna go to this application thing called Easy RP and double click it. And you wanna click run. And uh, you know, a smaller window will come out and uh, don't worry, it's not a virus, it's actually a virus. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> And if you do receive an antivirus warning, it's not a virus, okay? I'm 90% sure this is not a virus. I'm only 90% sure. It's definitely not a virus. Bruh. And with that, guys, you guys will have successfully done your Discord Hightail thing. Why is my image not working? All right, it turns out that I, I can't have a space there. So take note, guys, do not add a space there. And there we go, guys, it's now working. So now I have a fake Hightail gameplay thingy. Yeah, there we go, guys, that's how you do it. <laughs> WTF playing Hytale? LOL, it's fake. I found a way to do it. KYS! Alright guys, before I end this video off, there's a quick warning that I want to give you guys. As you know, this is actually a custom Discord rich present, so you can technically put any image you want and name the text whatever you want. Because you don't really have to just do Hytale. Let's say in the future, maybe the game of Binner is released and, and you want to look cool before the game is released and you want to put a fake Binner game or whatever. You know, <laughs> you know what I mean, guys? You can do that. This is fully customizable. You don't actually have to put the exact text I put in there. You can put any text you want, which is pretty cool. But do take note, guys, that Discord isn't very supportive of people doing this because well it's meant for official games not not for you to fake you know stuff you know what i mean guys be careful guys do not put offensive images or offensive text as your discord rich presence because discord can ban your account anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching this video hope this video allowed you guys to get some clout out of it i, I don't know i don't know why would you do this but and uh, yeah you guys have a limited amount of time to try this trick before this before hightail is actually released and uh, it's not cool anymore but i mean you can always pull this for like other future games i guess but with that guys thank you guys so much for watching this video and i'll catch you guys all next time drop it like it's hot